Hello, welcome. In this short video, let us look at an example illustrating how to calculate the angles between the body diagonals of a unit cube. That is, consider a cube with side length equal to 1. So, this is x axis, this is y axis and this is z axis. So, we have the cube with side length equal to 1. So, we want to find the angle between the vector 0, the vector OA, that is this body diagonal between O and the origin O and A and the diagonal between these two corners of the cube, that is B and, B and C. This is B, this is C. So, we want to find the angle between OA bar and BC bar. Obviously, the vector OA bar should be equal to 1 into x hat plus 1 into y hat plus 1 into z hat. The vector OA bar is defined as follows because the coordinates of the point A are 1 comma 1 comma 1 and coordinates of origin are obviously 0 0 0. So, the vector OA bar is this vector 1 into x hat 1 into y hat plus 1 into z hat. Next, the vector BC bar is equal to the vector BC bar is equal to B O bar plus O C bar. Therefore, this is also equal to O C bar minus O B bar because uh, vector A B bar is equal to minus B A bar. So, by using this formula, we have the vector B C bar is equal to O C bar minus O B bar. Clearly, O C bar is equal to x and y components of O C bar are clearly 0 and 0 and the z component is 1. So, it should be 1 into z hat minus of OB bar, and the, the vector OB bar is on the xy plane and the uh, value b or the point b is at the uh, one comma point 1 comma 1. So, uh, the vector OB bar is 1 into x hat plus 1 into y hat plus 0 into z hat. So, which can be ignored. So, this is equal to minus 1 into x hat minus 1 into y hat plus 1 into z hat. Thus, we have the vectors OA bar and the vector BC bar. Thus, we have the vector OA bar defined as follows and the vector BC bar defined as minus 1 into x hat minus 1 into y hat plus 1 into z hat. So, the angle between OA bar and BC bar is clearly cos inverse of the dot product of OA, dot product of OA bar with BC bar divided by the magnitude of OA bar into magnitude of BC bar. So, this is the angle between the two body diagonals. Clearly, the dot product OA bar dot BC bar is equal to the dot product of the vectors 1 into x hat, 1 into y hat, plus 1 into z hat dot product with minus 1 into x hat, minus 1 into y hat, plus 1 into z hat. So, which is equal to minus 1, minus 1, plus 1 because x hat the the product of 1 into x hat with the minus 1 into x hat is minus 1 and 1 into y hat with minus 1 into y hat is minus 1 and so on. So, this is equal to minus 1. And then the magnitudes of OA bar is then the magnitude of OA bar is equal to square root of 1 plus 1 plus 1 which is square root of 3. Clearly, the, the size or the dimension or of a body diagonal of a unit cube is equal to square root of 3. And since BC bar is also the a body diagonal, its length is square root of 3, which is also confirmed by the magnitude of this vector, which is equal to square root of 1 plus 1 plus 1, which is 3. Therefore, the product of the magnitude of OA bar with the magnitude of BC bar is equal to 3. Hence, the angle between the two body diagonals is to the body diagonals OA bar and BC bar is cos inverse of the dot product which is minus 1 and the uh, denominator which is the product of magnitudes is 3. So, which is equal to cos inverse of minus 1 by 3. This is nothing but equal to 109 7 degrees. Clearly, the this angle 109 degrees is the angle between uh, OA bar and BC bar on one side. On the other side of the diagonal, this angle should be equal to this angle is alpha. So, alpha is 109.47 degrees. Clearly, the other angle that is this angle or this angle which is can be defined as beta. Beta is equal to 180 minus alpha in degrees. 
Thanks for watching.